Mark, what's going on, buddy? It's Harris Sparks at uh, Randy Marion. I'm here at our Buick GMC location in Huntersville. It's a nice day outside. Uh, Mark, I wanted to go over this 2021 Yukon XL Denali that I've got here. Um, it's beautiful, beautiful red. It's a metallic red. A quick walk around to the outside quad tip exhaust that comes with the Denali's Denali badging there you got the Denali wheels that are specific for Denali chrome exterior trim color matched mirror caps GMC badging on the side you got these beautiful headlights. Your daytime running light is this around here. I can show you that as well. Let me see if it'll do it. Check that out. That's your turn signal. You got fog lights down here, LED fog lights. Uh, Denali unique uh, chrome grill right there with the GMC. Check out the lines on that hood too. I'm lucky the sun is here because you can kind of see the, uh, the sparkle in that paint finish. I'm going to hop on the inside here. This is what it looks like. It's a really, really light colored interior. Uh, going over the door, you do have this nice leather with the, look at that stitching. If you can see that. Check that out. It's beautiful. Leather around here. That's genuine leather. That's real leather. It's not fake. That's not that plastic that looks like leather. We've also got this wood trim around the door. Chrome right there. I've got memory seats, automatic windows, um, power mirror controls. Coming here, I do have automatic power seats right there, as well as that really nice stitching on the inside for the driver's seat as well. Denali badging on the seat. Mark, I've got my four wheel drive controls right here. These knobs are finished off in this chrome. That's gonna be a big difference between the Chevrolets. This vehicle is not, not equipped with automatic stop start. They did that to, to produce these vehicles quicker um, through the chip shortage. Um, so it's gonna be very very rare that you do not have that automatic stop start and that's a feature that not very many people like especially with these big 6.2 liter v8s you have a uh, lane keep assist parking um, assist sensors hill descent control your track control buttons right there your park and brake well all of your light controls are right here as well you do already have uh, uh, floor all weather floor liners installed Denali batching right there as well. I'm gonna hop in here, go over a little bit of the inside. <clears throat> Denali steering wheel. Uh, I've got a heated steering wheel, adaptive cruise control, all my good bits and bobs to control that screen and this screen. Now with Denali, it's the only one that's gonna be like this. It has a little bit of a different layout here. So we're gonna have a much flatter dashboard. It feels you know, a lot better down the road. Um, bigger screen right there. I've got a gloss black instrument panel right here. Um, it gives a very nice touch, especially against these uh, chrome accents on the inside here as well. Heated and cooled seats. You do have this little place down here where you can put your cups, uh, different bits and bobs, and you can charge different things down there as well. Let's start it up. All righty. Shut the door. All right, going over the instrument panel up here, you do have your lane keep assist, your four wheel drive controls are going to be visible there as well as your home screen. 
when I rev it up. So in this Denali, uh, I do have, this is the gear shift right here. I don't know if you're familiar with how those work. Uh, that's drive, going to reverse, neutral, and park. And you do have your low range with your plus and minus. You can shift gears if you want to. Uh, Mark, I do have built-in navigation, uh, wireless Apple CarPlay and Android Auto, as well as a 360-degree camera, all sorts of different camera views. I mean, it's it's nuts what you can see from the back, like from everything. If you tow a lot, that, that right there is going to be very, very helpful to you. Um, so, but that's the one that most people use. Coming over here, I do have a very nice big storage bin. Nice leather in there. A massive sunroof goes all the way back to your second row. I mean, check this out. This is a freaking luxury car. I, I would have this over, an, over a new Escalade. Um, you have your heads up display right there and I can change uh, the positioning of that I can also change what information I see up there so super nice <clears throat> now you do have Bose audio system in here turns up bumps it up thing is nice all right, I'm gonna hop to the back seat. We do have grandkids. Let's show you that rear entertainment system. All right, here's the entrance to the back seat. These doors are designed to open further out to have ease of entry for um, younger people. Your floors are protected if you have grandkids. You have all weather floor liners throughout the vehicle. Um, they can spill a milkshake. They can, you know, your dog can take a dump back here and it's not going to stay in the carpet because the, the uh, floor liners are going to protect you. Um, all of our vehicles have a resist all warranty on them so these light colored seats um, are not going to be affected. I'm going to show you we do have this is the uh, audio the system back here. Um, if you, once you wake it up you can listen to music you can watch uh, YouTube Chrome you, you can see what's on your phone up here um, by plugging it in down right there and one really cool thing is that you can go into navigate and your rear passengers can actually see where you are um, and they can also like I'm just gonna put in um, like Mooresville and I can send that and what that means is that it's going to send it up to the driver's screen. Is, is that not the coolest thing ever? So, you know, on these long drives and long road trips, your grandkids or whoever might be sitting back here, you can say, um, hey, Harris, uh, pull up an address for this and send it up here. And they can do it. You don't have to worry about fiddling on that screen, getting the, your passenger to fiddle on that screen. They can enter it up here and send it up to you. It's super, super cool. This high quality leather continues back here. I mean, all throughout the vehicle, you're going to have some of the nicest leather possible. Um, your third row is gonna have more space than it did the previous generation. Um, these have independent rear suspension, so they were able to lower the floor back here significantly. Now, let me hop out here and show you the trunk. So I do have two ways of getting back here. I can open up just the glass and I can see back here, uh, you do have rear seat back protectors. That, 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 that's one thing I was wondering if this one had, but it's got everything on it. And I can also open up the real trunk. Look at those quad tip exhausts. So much space back here. Uh, you do have power outlets if you want to go tailgating or whatever. You can plug up a cooler back there. Uh, you got these accessory uh, points where you can put a, a net back here. Um, GMC badging all throughout. 
Um, I can raise and lower the seats by the press of this button right here. And I can also, if you look right all the way up there, I can lower that as well. Super, super cool. Anyways, let me know what you think. I'm going to post this video to YouTube, let you take a look at it, and uh, we'll work a deal on it. Thanks, sir. Bye-bye.